Good morning and welcome to Mountain Patriot Homestead. I have a couple of days of vacation off and I thought I would come out to a place that allows me to clear my head and cleanse my soul. You hear a little background shuffling there, it's because I have my two guardians with me. They wanted to come down into the woods with me, which they always do. Um, and they're shuffling around in all these dry leaves. So I apologize for the background noise, but uh, I wouldn't leave, wouldn't leave home without them. Well, as you can see, I'm back here in the woods, back behind the house, and got the stream running behind me. I don't know how close you are to nature if you live somewhere where you can get out and enjoy the beautiful outdoors. Uh, I hope that you are in a situation where you can get out because I don't believe that there's anywhere, I know personally, there's nowhere that I can go that makes me relax, clears my head, it just makes me feel, I don't know, more calm and relaxed than being out in, uh, in a place like this. And I think it stems from the fact that um, I grew up being taught that this is a place, you know, nature is a place that I could come and um, be, be more in tune with not only myself, but my creator. Of course, I was too young to remember this story, but it was a story that my mom and dad uh, liked to tell me when I was growing up, is that the very first time my daddy took me hunting with him, I was two weeks old. Now, I can't imagine taking a two-week-old, uh, as the story goes, uh, he had me in one arm and his rifle in the other, but apparently um, that's, have no reason to not believe that story. And I do know that I grew up in the woods following my daddy around. Pepper, stop. I grew up in the woods following my dad around. And uh, between the woods and fishing bank, that was uh, where a lot of my memories go back to. And so I think those were my, my happy places in my memories. And so that's where I enjoy coming back to is uh, those type of places. There's so much going on in the world today, so much negativity, um, not only uh, with people, but just, I don't know, our situations, our attitudes. I know last week I've, I was going through a situation. Every morning I pray, you know, Lord, please let my mind be in a good place. Please bless me. Let my attitude be the right attitude. And if I need to be silent, let me be silent. And last week, I was really struggling. And so I'm glad that this week is a week that I could take a couple of days and just regroup my thoughts and kind of uh, get centered back within myself. And this is a perfect place for me to come to do that, uh, to just uh, sit in a little bit of silence. Uh, I, I don't believe that we should worship nature. I do not believe that at all. I believe we should worship the creator of all of this. And um, again, back, going back to my daddy, things that my daddy taught me is um, that, well, I'll, I'll tell you the story. Uh, one Easter, my daddy loved to fish, and that uh, must be genetic because I, I go, I love it too. And uh, one Easter, we were, uh, we, me and my mom and my dad went camping at Green River. And I'm, my, it may be possible that my little sister was born by then, but my memory's not that good anymore. But um, we were sitting on the banks of Green River, and me and my daddy were fishing, and. I knew with it being Easter that a lot of my friends were in church and I was sitting there and I was fishing and it, I, I just asked my daddy, uh, 
Daddy, should we be at church today? And my daddy kind of smiled and he, he never looked at me. He just continued fishing and he said, sister, and I, that's a good indication that my little sister was born because he started calling me sister after she was born. And he said, sister, look around you and tell me what you see. And I looked around and I described the hills to him and I described the trees and the water. And, and he said, that's right. He said, who made all of that? I said, God. And he said, that's right. He said, and if God made all of this, then isn't it a good thing? Uh, yes, sir. And he said, you know, there's no church where God lives any more than he does here. He said, because God's everywhere. Now, my daddy wasn't a real religious man. He believed in God, but it, he didn't attend church every Sunday. But I tell you, those words have stuck with me more than most any sermon I've ever heard is that God is everywhere and that everything he created, as it says back in Genesis, that he created all of this and it was good. So I'm not saying that we shouldn't go to church. I believe that we should. We should be with fellow believers. But I also think that sometimes these are the type of places that we need to come just to be calm and consider all that he has made. And if he took all the care with everything that's here down to each little piece of that moss, each little grain of sand, each drop of water, every leaf that's fallen off these trees, he knows every one of them. And if he knows all of that, he knows what's in our heart. And there's going to be times when my mouth gets the best of me, when I should have been quiet and I wasn't, when I let my temper go when I shouldn't have. There's going to be those times. And there's going to be times, you know, I just I have to ask for forgiveness for it because I'm not going to do everything that I should all the time. But the Lord knows what's in my heart and he knows how much I love him. And I thank him every day for everything he's given me. Because I know that I'm truly blessed because I've been in bad places and I've been in good. And I know that he's been in every one of those places. So thank you for joining me today. I'm glad that you could come out here in the woods with me as as this one is. And enjoy the, the peace and the solitude. I hope you can find a place that uh, calms you, relaxes you, <laughs> refreshes you. And I'm glad that you chose to watch this channel. If you have not subscribed, please do so. I would love to have you join our Mountain Patriot family. Just hit that subscribe button down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you have any comments, please leave those down below. Thank you. And I do hope you come back. I love you all. Mountain Patriot Homestead, signing out.